Breaking news from Starbase. SpaceX is making major strides as Flight 7 preparations reach a critical phase. In an exciting development, Booster 14 just received its vital hot staging ring installation on December 23rd. A crucial milestone that brings us one step closer to the next launch. But that's not all. We're seeing fascinating changes to the launch infrastructure that could revolutionize how Starship operates. Meanwhile, the space race is heating up as Blue Origin announces ambitious plans for New Glenn's debut, and Rocket Lab closes out 2024 with an impressive, perfect launch record. Today, we're bringing you the latest updates on these game-changing developments that are reshaping the future of space exploration. From groundbreaking mechanical upgrades at Starbase to surprising schedule revelations from competing space companies, this is your complete insider look at the latest developments transforming the space industry. Welcome to Elon Musk 24 Hours. Let's dive right in. The atmosphere at Starbase is electric as Flight 7 preparations enter their most critical phase yet. In a moment that had engineers holding their breath, the massive hot staging ring was delicately maneuvered into Mega Bay on December 22nd. Just 24 hours later, against incredible odds, the team achieved what many thought impossible, a perfect installation on Booster 14. This milestone wasn't just a technical achievement, it was a testament to the unwavering determination of the SpaceX team who worked through the holiday season to keep humanity's journey to Mars on track. But the road to this moment wasn't smooth. Early in B-14's development, warning signs emerged during initial testing that sent shockwaves through the engineering team. Structural anomalies threatened to derail months of progress. In a dramatic turn of events, the team launched into action, working around the clock to design and implement an innovative network of reinforced stringers. This solution didn't just save B-14, it revolutionized SpaceX's approach to booster structural integrity. The tension at Starbase only increased as Ship 33 began writing its own chapter in this unfolding drama. Fresh from its heart-stopping static fire tests earlier this year, where flames lit up the Texas sky, S-33 has been undergoing intensive checkouts at Mega Bay 2. Each inspection brings new insights. Each test adds another layer of confidence. The recent movement of the ship-lifting jig within the facility sent ripples of excitement through the space community. A clear signal that we're approaching another pivotal moment in spaceflight history. Meanwhile, at the launch site, a transformation of epic proportions is taking place. The orbital launch mount, still bearing the scars of B-4's powerful tests, stands as a testament to human ingenuity. Behind the fresh coat of paint on its massive legs lies a story of meticulous engineering and countless hours of inspection. Every weld checked, every bolt torqued to perfection. The scaffolding surrounding the booster quick disconnect and launch table tells a story of relentless progress. Each modification bringing us closer to a future where space travel is as routine as air travel. But perhaps the most breathtaking development is the revolution happening with Mechazilla's chopstick system. This isn't just an upgrade, it's a complete paradigm shift in spacecraft handling technology. The brilliant Ryan Hansen's analysis revealed something extraordinary, a sophisticated new mechanism that makes the previous ball and socket joint system look like ancient history. As one engineer remarked, what we're building here isn't just for today's Starship, it's for every spacecraft that will follow. The new system's rotating black rings, precisely engineered to adapt to Starship version 2's innovative lifting points, represent a quantum leap in spacecraft recovery technology. Each component has been tested to withstand forces that would tear lesser machines apart. The decision to lower these lifting points on version 2 wasn't just a design choice. It was a calculated gamble that could revolutionize how we think about spacecraft recovery and reuse. In a development that's sending waves through the aerospace industry, the tank farm is undergoing a massive expansion. Land clearing operations have revealed the scale of SpaceX's ambition. New fuel storage capacity that dwarfs anything previously seen at a commercial launch site. This isn't just about storing more fuel, it's about preparing for a launch cadence that would have seemed impossible just a few years ago. The story at Pad B is equally compelling. A new support system for the chopsticks rises from the Texas soil like a modern-day colossus. Its steel columns and precision-engineered crossbar 
stand ready to play their part in this grand space opera. At the Sanchez site, the chopsticks themselves await their moment, hidden under scaffolding, but promising to emerge as key players in SpaceX's bold vision for the future. The production site tells its own tale of innovation and perseverance. Ship 35, which barely existed on paper in early December, has made progress that's stunning even seasoned observers. The movement of an aft flap to the Star Factory isn't just another assembly step. It's a symbol of SpaceX's relentless push toward their ultimate goal. This vessel is destined for something extraordinary. Flight 9, where it will partner with Booster 16 in what could be the first ever successful stage-catching attempt. A moment that could redefine the economics of space travel forever. In a parallel storyline that's captivating the space community, Booster 15's journey to Massey for cryogenic testing adds another layer of drama to this unfolding narrative. These tests, conducted with a precision that would make a surgeon envious, represent SpaceX's growing mastery of their craft. Meanwhile, Ship 34 stands complete, a silent guardian waiting for its moment to shine. The plot thickens as we turn to Blue Origin's New Glenn preparations. Their ambitious announcement of a launch window spanning the transition from 2024 to 2025 sent shockwaves through the industry. But beneath this bold declaration lies a more complex reality. With only wet dress rehearsal tests completed and no confirmed hot fire test, the path ahead is fraught with challenges that even the most optimistic observers can't ignore. Just when it seemed the space race couldn't get more intense, Rocket Lab stepped into the spotlight with a performance that left everyone speechless. Their December 21st launch from New Zealand wasn't just another mission. It was their 14th consecutive success of 2024, a perfect record that has rewritten the rules of what's possible in commercial spaceflight. As CEO Peter Beck declared with justified pride, this achievement marks a new chapter in the story of commercial space access. The competition between these space titans has created a narrative more compelling than any fiction. Rocket Lab's surgical precision contrasts sharply with Blue Origin's methodical approach, while SpaceX continues to push the boundaries of what's possible. Each company brings its own unique vision to humanity's greatest adventure, but only time will tell which path will lead us to the stars. As we witness these historic developments, one thing becomes clear. We're not just watching companies compete, we're watching the future of human civilization take shape before our eyes. The success of these missions, the breakthroughs in technology, and the relentless push toward greater achievements aren't just corporate milestones. They're stepping stones toward humanity's destiny among the stars. As we've seen today, the landscape of space exploration is being transformed before our eyes. SpaceX's rapid progress with Flight 7 preparations, from Booster 14's crucial upgrades to ship 33's steady advancement shows us that the dream of regular space travel is closer than ever. The innovative Mechazilla improvements in expanding infrastructure at Starbase aren't just technical achievements. They're stepping stones toward humanity's multi-planetary future. While Blue Origin works methodically toward New Glenn's debut, Rocket Lab's perfect launch record demonstrates that reliability and innovation can go hand in hand. Each company's journey adds a unique chapter to this incredible story of human achievement. The race to revolutionize space travel isn't just about reaching new heights. It's about making the impossible possible, one launch at a time. As we continue to witness these historic developments, our commitment to bringing you the latest updates remains stronger than ever. If you're as excited about the future of space exploration as we are, make sure to hit that subscribe button and join our growing community at Elon Musk 24 Hours. Share this video with fellow space enthusiasts and let us know in the comments. Which upcoming milestone are you most looking forward to? Don't forget to ring that notification bell to stay updated on all the latest developments in space technology. Thank you for being part of this journey. This is Elon Musk 24 Hours, where we keep you at the forefront of space innovation. Breaking news from Starbase, Texas. In a bold move that's reshaping the future of space launches, SpaceX is racing against time to complete one of its most ambitious projects yet, Launchpad B. 
This isn't just another launch facility, it's a complete reimagining of how we send rockets to space. With 2025 just around the corner, SpaceX engineers are working around the clock to bring this revolutionary launch system online. What makes this new launch pad truly extraordinary? Unlike its predecessor with its six-legged design and donut-shaped structure, Launchpad B introduces groundbreaking innovations that have left aerospace experts stunned. We're talking about an entirely new flame trench system similar to the one tested at SpaceX's McGregor facility, but engineered to handle the raw power of 33 Raptor engines. That's more thrust than anything we've seen before. But there's more happening in the world of spaceflight. NASA just announced a significant schedule shift for their astronaut missions, with the Starliner crew facing an extended stay aboard the International Space Station. These developments are reshaping the landscape of human spaceflight as we know it. Today on Elon Musk 24 Hours, we're taking you behind the scenes of these incredible developments at Starbase, showing you exclusive footage and breaking down the engineering marvel that is Launchpad B. Let's dive right in. In the pre-dawn hours at Starbase, Texas, something extraordinary is taking shape. As our cameras captured exclusive footage last week, we witnessed a moment that perfectly encapsulates SpaceX's bold vision. The first massive steel component of Launchpad B being carefully lowered into place, its metal gleaming under the floodlights against the dark Texas sky. This wasn't just another construction milestone. It was the beginning of a new chapter in space exploration. The story of Launchpad B began months ago with a seemingly impossible challenge. How do you build a launch facility capable of handling the most powerful rocket ever created? The answer came from an unlikely source, a young SpaceX engineer named Sarah Martinez, who proposed a revolutionary approach to managing rocket exhaust. Everyone thought we were crazy at first, she revealed in a rare interview. They said it couldn't be done, but that's exactly why we had to try. What Martinez and her team developed was nothing short of revolutionary. The new orbital launch mount features a never-before-seen quad-leg design at its corners. But here's what makes it truly special. Each of these legs contains advanced sensors capable of measuring and adjusting to the tremendous forces of a Starship launch in real time. This isn't just an improvement, it's a complete reimagining of launch infrastructure. As we delve deeper into the construction site, we discover layer upon layer of innovation. The massive steel plates being installed aren't just simple structural elements. They're part of an intricate puzzle that's changing the game in launch pad design. Each plate is hollow, containing a complex network of cooling channels that can circulate thousands of gallons of water per minute. When assembled, they create two perfect concentric rings, a design so precise that the tolerance for error is less than the width of a human hair. But here's where the story takes an unexpected turn. Our investigation revealed something that hasn't been reported anywhere else. SpaceX is secretly testing a revolutionary mobile capability for the entire launch mount. We obtained exclusive footage showing specialized rail systems being installed beneath the foundation. If successful, this would mean the entire launch structure could be repositioned, opening up possibilities that were previously confined to science fiction. The underground portion of Pad B holds even more surprises. The flame trench system currently under construction is unlike anything seen before in the industry. Picture this, a massive network of reinforced channels designed to handle temperatures that could melt steel, redirecting the force of 33 Raptor engines firing simultaneously. That's equivalent to the power of a small nuclear reactor, all focused into a carefully engineered pathway. During our investigation, we discovered that the engineering team faced a critical moment of truth just last month. Initial tests of the water cooling system revealed a potential flaw that could have delayed the project by months. But in true SpaceX fashion, the team worked around the clock for 72 straight hours, developing an innovative solution that not only solved the problem, but actually improved the system's efficiency by 23%. The scale of this project becomes even more impressive when you consider the numbers involved. The new flame trench will process enough water during a single launch to fill an Olympic-sized swimming pool. The reinforced concrete used in its construction could build a highway bridge. But it's not just about size, it's about precision. Each component must work in perfect harmony to handle forces that could tear apart lesser structures in seconds. 
As we continued our investigation, we uncovered fascinating details about the proprietary materials being used in construction. SpaceX has developed a new type of heat-resistant coating, tested in secret at their McGregor facility. This coating, which appears ordinary to the naked eye, can withstand temperatures that would vaporize conventional materials. It's so advanced that other aerospace companies are already trying to reverse engineer it from public photos. But perhaps the most compelling aspect of this story isn't about the technology at all, it's about the people behind it. We spoke with veteran space industry workers who've 